Well, most of us are familiar with the nutrition labels on the side or the back of packages, but increasingly on the front, you have little labels that say, hey, this is a healthy choice. It's a system put in place by manufacturers, but now the government is taking aim. Eat a bowl of cocoa puffs for breakfast, and General Mills says you've made a healthy choice. Kellogg's Fruit Loops, too, qualifies for the smart choice label. What's wrong with making this a smart choice? Well, when it has 40% sugar, you know, can you picture that half the box with grain and half the box with sugar? That's not a, such a smart choice. Michael Jacobson also points to Kraft's Strawberry Bagelful, which he says is stuffed with cream cheese and strawberry puree sweetened with sugar and colored with red dye 40. It, too, has a smart choice label. Smart choice is just one of many systems designed by grocery stores, scientists, or manufacturers themselves to steer health-conscious shoppers to supposedly nutritious products. You have these different conflicting systems, and some of them are flawed, that not-so-healthy foods get the symbol. That's concerning the FDA, too, which is why the agency has now warned food companies it is analyzing labels that appear to be misleading. Those behind the Smart Choice label insist their ranking system is valid. It's not the perfect program, but it's a program that's going to move America. There's nothing about these criteria that are not grounded in science. But the FDA says all these different systems are confusing. It hopes to develop a nutritional gold standard for products that are labeled healthy. And it may also push for one simple label that everyone would have to use.